Well, hi there, I'm Dr. Dan Newsom, and today we're talking about gut health and how it relates to your overall health. If you like what you're learning and want to learn more, subscribe to our channel so you can watch more videos just like this. Let's jump right into this. A parasite is an organism that lives inside or on another organism and can't live on its own. Okay, a parasite uses the host's resources to survive. Now, 70% of all parasites are microscopic and can't be seen by the naked eye. Although, some can grow as long as 30 meters. Whew. The strength of your immune system and the health of your microbiome are the determining factors to whether or not you become a parasite's host. Anyone that eats pork or raw fish from sushi uh, is exposed to parasites. Traveling or having pets are other great ways to catch parasites. Now, being that we're humans, we have you know, trillions and trillions of microorganisms living inside us. Humans are simply not immune to parasites. Okay, hygiene is essential, but it's not enough. You know, just wanted to let you know that I'm not trying to freak you out. You got all the worms inside you, yada yada yada, right? But I want to bring this information to your awareness so that you understand these issues and you can help yourself. Now, not all parasites are worms. Okay, some are single-celled microorganisms and others are worms. Okay, but others are like bacterial parasites and they cause other diseases like Lyme disease. Uh, parasites cause so many different types of symptoms due to the wide range of the types of parasites and where they affect the human body. All right? uh, common symptoms are, you know, common symptoms of parasite infection are frequent stomach aches, diarrhea, severe gas, skin issues like rashes and things like that, nightmares, uh, sleep disorders. Uh, fatigue, inability to gain weight, irritability, headaches, you know, among others, okay? Most of them affect our gut and digestive system, while others are, are more blood-borne, right? And they even will take up residence in other parts of our bodies, like uh, our, our liver, kidneys, lungs, and even the brain. Uh, as a matter of fact, something to realize is that wherever parasites are, they cause inflammation and degeneration. They wear out the immune system and they set the stage for other diseases. Now, many chronic illnesses are caused or at least partially caused by parasites. And these are Lyme disease, many autoimmune disorders, and even some types of cancer. So when should you do a parasite cleanse? Well, that depends on where you are in your particular health journey. In other words, you, you want to be careful, okay? And have someone guide you through it. Okay, for example, if you're, you're struggling with your health, okay, and you're in a weakened state, I personally wouldn't walk you through a parasite cleanse. Not until I build you up to assure that you can handle the detox process of getting rid of parasites. Okay, before doing a detox or a parasite cleanse of any kind with my patients, I give them the following products. I give them equalizer, my equalizer, concentrate, uh, gut health, Newsom's Digest, digestive detox. And these help get things moving in their system, help build them up so that they're capable of detoxing when they start eliminating parasites. See, I, I hold to the belief that changing the internal environment of the body is key to long-lasting relief uh, from parasitic infections or any type of infection of any kind. Okay, so when you change the environment, you stop being the place for them to live and thrive. So remember that parasites love sugar, okay? They love dairy, they love carbs and junk food, all right? But also remember that overeating is a great way to keep these guys nice and happy, okay? Because when you overeat, there's excess waste, and that waste is exactly what they love to eat. Okay, I tell my patients that there's, you never have an infection that you didn't grow. So I've seen many cases over the years where people found out they had 
parasites, okay? We're told to do a parasite cleanse right away. They start on the cleanse and their health starts to decline, okay? The reason for that is the, the, their body couldn't eliminate all the toxins that were being released by those parasites, okay? And it made their internal environment worse. This is why I don't sell a parasite cleanse on my website, okay? I do have a parasite cleansing program, but when I approach this issue, I always follow this process, okay? I work at detoxing different areas and then keeping those areas clear as we work on through the entire body, okay? I always start with the colon, move on to the liver, then the kidneys, then the lymphatic system, and finally the bloodstream, okay? And as one clears, you move on to the next, but you gotta keep the last one cleared as you progress through the whole body, okay? To, this is so we change the internal environment and we, we, we actually have a lasting cleanse from parasites and the parasite cleansing becomes successful. Okay, so the products that I use to support parasite cleansing from my line are uh, super curcuminoids, inflammagon, digestive detox, gut health, and Newsom's Digest. Okay, these are what I use with myself and my family and my patients. If you think you have parasites, okay, make sure you talk to your healthcare provider. If you're looking for my parasite detox protocol, please write the email here on the screen and one of my health coaches will help you through the process. I hope you've enjoyed today's topic. This is Dr. Newsom bringing you optimal health naturally.